God damn it. Not even here on the on the train. Oh well. Uh, what's going on? In fact, they consider me a suspect now. How much longer they're gonna do this? Should be busy preparing for the school festival now. Why is school decided to have the festival so late anyway? Because I'll be changing our day just because our school's all over the news. Moving to next Tuesday only makes it more work for us. Ah. I mean, it's fine. Chill, chill out, guys. I got this. Well, I don't, but, you know. Speaking of the annoying media, we've been getting phone calls at the faculty office. The absurd uh, absurdity of y'all's. Who exactly are the fans of these? That's what we want to know. We really have no clue uh, what method they're using. Killing someone without directly interacting with them is like magic. But magic's not real. Speaking of magic, did you know that there's a magic in math too? A magic square. It's a square with in which adding up the numbers in any row, column, or diagonal gives you the same total. Oh god. No two squares. Oh god, it's, it's like Sudoku, isn't it? Let's have a look. I can't figure this out for life of me. Why is it five? It's five, but why? Correct. A three by three square has uh, has only one pattern, but a four by four square has eight hundred and eighty uh, possibilities. Jesus. Nice going. I guess so. Sure, that, that's great. Right. My knowledge, my maxed out knowledge. If you had to choose, you, uh, would you try to find a phantom piece or solve a 200 million magic squares? Uh, Mass is killing me. Mm. Kinda does. Kill me. Uh, what now? Questionnaires. The festival dates will change because of the situation. We need to hurry and tally the results. Ah, uh, no worries. Can't be counting on you, Haru. It'll be fine. Don't worry. Time to be doing crap like this. You don't need to keep mentioning it. We're doing this to keep suspicions off of us, remember? Goro Akechi. This one too, Akechi. They're mostly the same over here as well. People want him, I guess. Everyone's so eloquent when they can be anonymous. It's like they never accepted us to begin with. It would be nice if you did some work too, Ryuji kun. He came to help us count these, right? No, he didn't. Come on, leader. Can you tell him too? Take this seriously. We're gathering information too. You know, like uh, online and stuff. I guess that's one way of saying it. Oh, look here. This ain't good. Criminal profiling? Oh, the acts of thievery committed by the Phantom Thieves are mere fakes. And their true goal is murder? Every heart they changed before Okumura was just a warm-up? Well... Uh, so now they're accusing us of being a bunch of killers. God, this is so effing stupid! Damn it! Well, I'm getting shit on. Results. First place is Goro Akechi. What? Akechi? What are you so surprised for? We've been mentioning him this whole time! Yeah, you... Never mind. Seriously? Not some singer or an idol? It's because of us that his popularity has skyrocketed. We're the ones counting the results. Can't we just make him up? We don't have to get him. People will figure that out. He won by a landslide. 
I knew people would vote for him, but this is way more votes than I was expecting. It would be best for us to avoid inviting such a clear danger upon ourselves. I'd like a little more time to think about who to ask. That reminds me. How is Futaba-chan doing? We are going to have to ask Akechi to come in, aren't we? She seemed like she was looking into something on her own. Has she told you anything? Not a word. Let's leave it to her. We're not gonna get arrested because the police tracked her down, right? That's the last thing we need now. Even one clue would work wonders for us. We should let her continue with her own investigation. I hope Indeed. she finds something. Look at this table of Max Esslings. Yo. Hey. In response to the police identifying the Phantom Thieves as primary suspects, Goro Akechi had this to say. Even though my opinion has been met with criticism, I've held fast that the Phantom Thieves are not just. Shut your However, fucking mouth. I believe oh. the recent series of suspicious deaths is unrelated to their actions. But now you're making what? sense. Did I hear you correctly? Okay. But Akechi-san, you were the first to caution everyone about the Phantom Thieves. Were you not? This doesn't change the fact that they are indeed a dangerous group. That said, I would like to express that immediately linking them to this case is far too hasty. Man is talking sense now. There are still many questions to be answered here. It feels as though there is more to this. That's good. After this conference, Akechi-san announced he will be limiting his media appearances and... I wonder why the sudden change... Maybe he's got to change of heart. I'm super stuck on my Akuma investigation. Even you're having trouble with this shit? What should we do? Tomorrow? That'll be a better, right? Imagine what eight hits might produce. Right, let's sort it out tomorrow. What are you staring at your phone like that for? Oh, are you going through a breakup? It's a secret. Don't let things get complicated, okay? I Have just got together with Makoto. I'm not breaking up. Relax. By the way, you haven't been causing any trouble, have you? I heard the police showed up at your school. No, it's, a, it's, eh, it's nothing about me. As long as you're not getting involved. <sighs> well, fine. Good. Right. Fucking max intelligence. And I can't do, oh wait, I can't do that yet. I just need to be kind. Let's go sort the rest of the laundry out by Kawakami and uh, go work for the uh, go work for the, uh, the, uh, the the flower shop. Okay. Mm. Hi. Flower shop. Flower shop. Work. Work. Alright. Large flowers with minimal aroma. So big stinky flowers. No, big small, big not stinky flowers. A large, strong scented flower. Uh, so with little scent. Oh my god! Because I read the stupid flower book, I, I can I can see shit now. So go. It's a soft scent. So yeah, there we go. Big flower, small small less stinky aroma. Uh, large, sweet light pink flower gives. 
large doll center. There we go. Large flower. I guess so. That should be good. Here you go. Thank you. That's great. Nice. Money, money. Yeah, yeah. My kindness. Yes. Hmm. Three kindness. Wanna head back? Yeah, uh, uh, yeah, let's do that. And Kawakami's gonna come back with me, me laundry. Thank you. Right, that's good. Doki. Makoto, has Nijima-san told you anything about the investigation? Well, Sis actually stopped mentioning anything about work in front of me. It's possible I made some sort of mistake. Regardless, I thought over the matter of who we're going to invite for our school festival. He's gonna be a Kechi, isn't it? I'm considering it? asking a Kechi-kun. For real? Weren't you talking about how you didn't want to draw danger to us or whatever? He doesn't know it's us yet. I understand this is dangerous. But without a powerful source of intel, we won't be able to win against the police network. And I can no longer rely on my sister for information. Wait, is this because of Akechi-kun's police connections? Close enough, I guess. I don't know. You're going to use him as your powerful source of intel? Bold move. I'm surprised to hear that suggestion coming from you, Makoto. Did you see his press conference yesterday? One of his comments defending the Phantom Thieves stood out to me. There is more to this. I think he said that knowing for certain that the Phantom Thieves would be watching. Still, there will be so many other students at the school festival. What are the odds of success? It's a gamble. Okay. And the odds are less than favorable. But we can no longer afford to hesitate. Fair enough. What are your thoughts? Should be fine. Okay then. Is everyone else okay with that? I'm good. Whatever he says has got to be more reliable than what I've been able to come up with. It would be reassuring to gain him as an ally, rather than simply a source of information. Hold on, how are we even going to get in touch with him? It's not like we got his contact info. We have all the data from the PC of a public prosecutor. Finding his phone number was a no-brainer. Nice. Damn, you're real impressive. I guess. But then, wouldn't he wonder how we acquired his number? I'll just say my sister had it. That isn't even technically a lie. Can you send me the number, Futaba? All our phones fit, in, fit into later. pockets. Gotta say, I'm really not big on this Akechi deal. It'll be fine. Now's no time to be petty. Just think of him as a source of intel, nothing more. I have a response already. He says, let me think about it. Wait a sec. Didn't he say he wasn't gonna do any more stuff for the media? That's likely why he's so hesitant. Okay. What are we going to do if he turns us down? I'll keep trying. Maybe frustrating, but he's all we have at the moment. I guess so. We're counting on you, Makoto. I guess we are. Don't want to rely on Akechi too much, but you know, we can't really 
do anything about it. Can I leave? I can. I can't make Kawakami can do anything for me, so... Time to work at the... Uh... Oh wait, since I can't do that yet, Kawakami, you can make, co hey. make coffee. Your clothes and I'm Hi. going to, uh, I'm going to work at the fucking flower shop. Kindness up. I'll work here. Is that an order? Nope. It's fine. How are you feeling? Good kindness up. Just need to keep at it. Just need to keep working on my kindness. Hi. It took so long just to make one coffee. Twenty four percent. Oh boy. Support went to shit, Lamau. Hey. Uh. Oh boy. So Akechi <laughs> is coming. But he said he think about it. And we know because we're on the committee. Test results? Okay, class, let's get started. I'm the advisor for the ESS, so I'll be help busy helping them today. ESS stands for English Study Society, by the way. We need to advertise that Shujin's a school that can prov that provides an education you can use anywhere in the world. Hey, huh. There are tons of three letter acronyms like ESS I in the world. An answer. S uh isn't it save isn't SOS like save our soul? No, it was meaningless of Hanny. That's correct. SOS often said to mean save our ship. Save our souls is another interpretation too. But in reality, it's not an acronym of anything. It's the simplest thing you can send in Morse code in, in case of an emergency. If you haven't finished preparing for the festival though, it's too late to send an SOS now. Oh, Holy shit, learning new stuff. Festival, huh? But I catch you really be there. Yeah. How'd you do? I'm dead. Look at that. I'm top of the class. Oh yeah. The ma mask of an honor student. All right. I am top of the class. Class. Huh? Any words from a catchy? Nothing. Hmm. Yep. Okay. It's a lot of circumstances sur uh, surrounding our school. I'll let you know if any progress is made on that front. What's up? Dodge. I don't need my charm to increase. I'm already on max. All right. But I did dodge a uh, a projectile, so I think I was pretty cool. Yeah, just a little bit. There he is. Huh. Welcome home. Why are you here? Why you ask? I just came to enjoy some delicious coffee. I still dislike you, buddy. You 
Take a look around. Is the Nijima lady doing well? Unfortunately, we haven't seen each other lately. We had a difference of opinion. What are your thoughts, Representative Shido? Hmm? It oh, is that fucker? Me that people say our country is lethargic. We've let these phantom thieves run amok. No, fuck this guy. That man's voice. And because they've targeted only prominent figures, our government leaders have been hesitant to act. I apologize for any concern they may have caused, and will henceforth search for an apt countermeasure. That politician's really honorable. I like how quick he says he's gonna do everything. This is an important undertaking, and one I intend to confront with every asset available to me. Shit. The selfish criminals enacting this social reform are in fact the ones most deserving of reformation. Answering to the interests of the people as hastily as possible is my natural duty as a politician. Man, this guy is admirable. Shut the fuck up. Rampant political scandals. Thieves on the loose. As sad as it is, this is the state of our nation. We must resolve this problem. And I assure the people of this noble country that I will do just that. Twice now. What are you standing there staring off into space for? You're creeping me out. You're standing too. Standing here is my job. That politician is honest and carries an overwhelming amount of charisma. It feels like a trustworthy leader for Japan has finally come forth. Don't you, you think? You keep telling us? yourself that, buddy. Sorry, <laughs> wasn't listening. Criminals, hmm? Well, that must be how he sees it. However, that is ignorant of their true nature. True nature? If these people attack others with no remorse, why would they make a teacher and an artist apologize? Could a murder truly have been enacted by the same group? If this Sukumura incident was not the Phantom Thieves, if they only changed the hearts of criminals, then even though they can't be considered innocent, Perhaps my goals are not so different from theirs. Are you a fanboy? <laughs> I knew there was something special about you. Ever since the first time we met. Don't I say I that. Tell you anything during our conversation. No, you can't. I'm not your friend. All right. Oh, that reminds me. I've been invited to a panel at Shujin Academy, and... Ah, uh, wait. I'm sure you know that already. Considering it's such a good opportunity, I've decided to accept the offer. Thank you for the coffee. It was delicious. Glad you liked it. Well... I'm happy I could see you. I'll I'm not. Now. I'm in a relationship. Go away. Don't get out like that. Ah, I already knew that. Oh, come on. That sounds good. I suppose if you say it like that, I can resign myself to enjoy the time too. Kawakami, you can make the tools. I haven't even had like the chance to. Okay. I haven't had the chance to like actually, um, you know, go into the afternoon to go into mentors yet. So that's something, right? Uh. 
I have a bouquet request, please handle it. I'm counting on you. Thank someone. Right. So, just to say thank you. I suppose one invoking memories or happy futures would be acceptable. Evoked with love of memories. Uh, let's see. Happy future. Give it to your precious one. Thank you. Here we go, buddy. That's great. Yeah. I did it. Nice. Hmm. Woo. Max rank. Of course not. Of course not yet. Wanna head back? It was never gonna be this easy. Hi. Thank you. Dropping is so annoying. The festival seems to be a success. There's definitely a lot more people than last year. Well, yeah, this place got famous and all. Look at those assholes with the face mask. Phantom thieves, Kamoshida, Principal Kobayakawa. On top of that, we got to catch you as a guest. There may be police officers in plain clothes, too. Actually, they probably are here. We better be careful about what we discuss. Acting like normal students is going to be important. Let's just have fun. What do you normally do at a school festival? Chill. Look around at the exhibits and eat stuff? There's no rules. Remember when we went to the beach before? Why not go about it like that? Just enjoy yourself. I think I can do it if I've got everyone with me. You are so laid back. There's a possibility that your name and Ryuji's have come up. A number of the teachers had been questioned before, and even we were interviewed the other day, too. Don't let your guard down too much. It's Fair enough. The initial members have been at this for a long time, making it easier to get tracked. All right. Now, now, let's leave it at that. We just need to be mindful about what we're saying, correct? Oh, um. You seem to be having quite a lot of fun, Haru. You did mention that you were looking forward to this. I want to go around with everyone and eat at the refreshment stands. So let's do that. It'll be a nice change of pace. A lot of nasty stuff's continued lately. Shall we head off to the stands then? Sounds like end plan. Let's do it. All right. This is your first time at our school festival. They're pretty good. From what I've heard. I know a great one. Follow me. We all did like a little tank control turn as well. Look at that nerd. Takoyaki? New customers! I'll show you all to your seats. So, it's your classes stand. It's still a refreshment stand, isn't it? It's like a deserted island here. Well, I guess it's good for talking since there aren't any people here. We heard a lot of rumors even on our way here. And it was all bullshit. Relax, Ruji. Act normal. Who cares? There's nothing normal about this anymore. Welcome home. May I take your order? Take my order? W what happened to the maid atmosphere? There are a lot of odd flavors. Stick to a normal one. I bet they... I'm so sorry. We sold our last normal one to the previous customer. There was another customer before us? The hell... Well then, I'll have the mentai cheese takoyaki. That sounds amazing, actually. 
I'm sorry. We're out of cod bro. Then how about the squid? Um, we're currently out catching squid. It'll probably take another five or six hours. What can we have then? That doesn't even sound remotely possible. Ain't this whole menu just a sham? Actually, we spent most of our budget on making the maid costumes look nice. We didn't put too much effort into the octopus. Oh, I can see that. Yuji, you're making a scene. Then, what would you recommend with what you have now? That would be the Russian takoyaki. We'll have that, please. This will take a little time. Uh, uh, let's forget about the octopus and get back. Russian takoyaki? On that note, hearing Kamoshida being almost treated like a victim makes me want to eat my stress away. I've even heard conjecture that the principal was targeted for reasons like he knew too much. I kept hearing about Goro Okechi's popularity. All thanks to the Phantom Thieves. You know, did that Akechi guy agree to show up here because he believes we didn't kill anybody? Or he may simply love large gatherings. Oh, true. He didn't seem like he minded being pampered by the media at all. He's such a dick. We plan on stealing intel, but we might fall into another trap. I'm gonna be bummed if that happens. That is possible. We won't let that happen. Still, it doesn't change the fact that we don't know what Akechikun is planning. Food's here. Thank you for the wait. That's a tiny box. Ooh, it's fresh made. Lies, I heard a microwave go off. Well, it's not like I was expecting crispy takoyaki at a school festival or anything. So, what makes this a Russian takoyaki? Could there be jam in it as a secret ingredient? That sounds quite delicious. Well, one of these is special. Uh, Big red one. one. Of them's obviously red. That's gotta be the one. Dude, don't tell me the Russian part means... It's like, going for the obvious one is manly. Is that so? Well, I'd prefer the most beautifully shaped one. But all of them are misshapen. Oh, aren't you all going to eat? I think I'll go for the special one. Wait, is she honestly going for it? Do you want to go for the red one? I'll take it. Think it'll be spicy? If Haru wants it, she can have uh, it. Well, yeah. Oh, everyone's all here. Russian, as in Russian roulette. Oh God, the, damn it! The panel isn't until tomorrow, though. I came to check out the venue. I can't make any mistakes, since a lot of people will be present. Someone's eager. But people ended up recognizing me. Everyone bombarded me with questions. That's because you were sloppy. I grew tired of the baseless rumors they kept bringing up. So I escaped to where there weren't any people. Don't take the one. one of these. Wait, you can't just come over and say, and look at people's food and say, I'm going to eat your food. <gasps> the special one. Let's just call this my performance fee. I hope you die. It's fine. Hmm. It's quite the... <laughs> Eating it in one bite is a bad idea. <gasps> my throat. Uh, this is... <sighs> oh, my stomach. Uh, it burns. You deserve all everything of this. Okay? Do you need water? Uh, 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 I'm... I'm fine. Uh, I just love, uh... Spicy... Uh, spicy stuff. <laughs> hey, does he sound broken to you? Good. Well then, I'll I'll see you uh, t -t -t tomorrow. Get out of here. Wow, he's really trying to hold it together. He's waddling around like some comedian. It's like he wants to get picked up for some commercial or something. But did he truly come to simply check the venue? This isn't good. I keep suspecting every little thing. I know what you mean. I'm doing the same too. I need to do my best tomorrow. 
I'm gonna pull this off no matter what. Cool. That a catchy guy. When he got here, didn't he say that everyone's all here? Everyone? How does he know ev everyone, huh? You're here just imagining things. Are, are we? That is actually really, really suspicious. Hmm. Mm, yes, but this associated mental fatigue was extraordinary. Being cautious takes a lot out of you. Seriously, I am. I think I'm tired. Oh God, <laughs> everyone's tired. <laughs> Why don't you all go home and rest up? Mm. Oh boy. Oh boy, now we gotta wait for Akechi to come to our school? This is gonna go swimmingly well. well. Hey. Can leave? Can't leave. I should write something. Of course I can't leave. Why would I be able to leave? Nice. Ugh. <sighs> Seems like no one really likes us that much now. Such a shame. Well then, we will now begin today's panel. Our guest of honor is Goro Akechi. I feel kind of bad considering how many people have gathered. I'm sure you all would have been happier to have a singer or a mascot appear, wouldn't you say? We'd appreciate it. <laughs> He knows. Nothing. He talks about the Phantom Thieves are dangerous, yet he says they haven't committed any murders. Either he has an idea who the true culprit is, or he has uncovered the identities of the Phantom Thieves. Come on, Makoto. You gotta get it out of him. Ah, uh, it's pressure, man. As much as you're allowed to say, would you tell us how far along your investigation is on them? Getting right to the point, I see. Well, if it's as much as I'm allowed to say, then everything on TV and the internet is all of it. We don't have any leads yet, and the methods behind their crimes are still unclear. I see. Even with this country's power, arresting them is proving to be difficult. Is that the case? I wouldn't phrase it that way, but, well, something like that. Thank you for answering that question. By the way, it seems you've denied a correlation between the Phantom Thieves and the murders. Why the sudden change? Until now, haven't you upheld your stance that the Phantom Thieves are dangerous? How are you so positive that they haven't committed murder? Are you a little too comfortable interrogating people? Why, it's as if you're a prosecutor. <sighs> Excuse me. This is something I've personally been interested in, so I couldn't help it. But won't you tell us? What reason is there that you'd claim their innocence when you previously stated they were unjust? Mako-chan's really pressing for an answer. She's pelting him with questions. That's good, isn't it? Every person whose heart they changed have truly been criminals, including Okumura. Why then was he the only one who needed to be killed? Why is that? I must admit, I couldn't deduce a reason. That's why I believe that case should be thought of as if a different party is responsible. It was a different party. If, this is all hypothetical, mind you. If the Phantom Thieves are the ones I know of, I can't possibly imagine they would kill anyone. Your comment just now. Does this mean the police have already identified who they are? Oh, no. The police haven't gotten that far yet. Oh, but you have? But I have my own conclusions about the true identities of the Phantom Thieves. He's gotta be bluffing. Pipe down. He's lying, right? But if it's the truth... You're not going to ask me who they are? It may 
may have repercussions on the investigation. Are you sure you can share that with us? It's only my personal opinion, so announcing that here wouldn't pose a problem. Go on then. However, there is a possibility that everyone present will hear the truth before the police or media. The truth? What's he planning on saying? Go on. It's quite the confidence you have. If you're so certain, then very well. I'd like to ask you then. Who do you think the Phantom Thieves are, Akechi san? That idiot! No. She's there's yeah. no way he could have any evidence. They're people you all know quite well. The identity of the Phantom Thieves are. Oh, it's mine. I apologize for the interruption, but I can't turn off my phone due to my job. Would you mind if I step away for about 10 minutes or so? Oh, come on. I'm terribly sorry, everyone, but we'll be taking a break. We'll resume the panel in 10 minutes. Please don't troll me online for this interruption. I'll <laughs> Is there a room I may use? There's the PE faculty office. I want you to come too. There's a matter I want to discuss. Your friends from yesterday are here, aren't they? Can you bring them too, if that's all right? Oh shit. Did you set this up? We only have 10 minutes, you know. Bastard. Fine, but let's do it. What do you want to talk about? No. Oh, Carl. Okay, crap. That's gotta be shocked. I have video footage too. Please, let's not feign ignorance. All of you can go to that other world too. Yes. Two. Us two. It's not just all of you. I am aware of that world, too. I also know that when you traverse over there, your appearance changes as well. It's because of those mysterious powers, isn't it? I found out about that world about a month ago. This had been installed onto my phone without my knowledge. Dude, it's the NAV. When the app activated on its own, the scenery around me suddenly changed. Quite frankly, I still can't believe it myself. Shit. But from the look of these photos, all of you seem quite used to it. We've been listening to you blab on for a while now, but cut the delusional... All of you are acting as phantom thieves in the metaverse. I can say so with conviction because I have the same power as you. Ellipses. I'll take your silence as confirmation. In all honesty, I've been curious about you since the time of the Matarame case. Shit. But to think it would end up like this. We didn't kill anyone. I believe that as well. How can you be so sure? Because I saw another. The real culprit. Is she- Oh For shit, real? is he gonna tell us his side? Who was it? I couldn't identify his face. He had a mask on after all. Actually, when I took these photos, I entered that world, too. That's when I saw someone else moving about, besides all of you. He shot at me the moment he noticed me. That's who killed President Okumura? Most likely. At the very least, I was almost killed by him. I can't die here. I need to determine the truth. When those thoughts overcame me, I awakened to that power. A most fortunate accident. This guy has a persona too? This cat. Oh. I swear it just talked. No, it didn't. Morgana, our teammate who taught us about the metaverse. Really? This is unbelievable. But it is true that you know things that I don't. Say, Morgana. Were you also the one who instructed them on how to change people's hearts? I experienced that world too. But I still haven't solved that mystery yet. We go in the metaverse, or we call them palaces, to steal the core of their desires, their treasure. And those whose treasure has been stolen have a change of heart. 
Ah. <laughs> well, there's certainly no way anyone could figure out such an MO. Anyways, back to what you were talking about. Are we in this mess because of that guy? Although I don't completely understand the method, all you do is simply reform people. Someone else is behind the murders. However, Great. the police have decided that the Phantom Thieves did it. They'll arrest you at this rate. They're going to treat me as my father's murderer? I can't overlook such a grave mistake. Which is precisely why I want us to strike a deal. I may be able to save you from this situation. A deal? What do you want? I would like you to cooperate with me on investigating the truth. And if we decline? And I think I'll have to inform the police about all of you. Along with that video I mentioned. This ain't no deal, it's blackmail! Say what you will. This is the method that I believe is correct. The justice I uphold will not tolerate criminals who kill people at their leisure. Justice. Right. Justice. You've heard that Sai San is the one spearheading the investigation about you Phantom Thieves, correct? Yeah. The higher what about? ups are concerned only with settling the case. They want to capture the culprits behind the psychotic breakdown incidents and end the commotion. Those are the ones who are putting pressure on Sai San. I can only imagine her impatience. What of evidence that we did it? How do they intend on proving it? Even if there's no objective explanation to the method, it's over once causality is established. Sai San can't make rational judgments at the moment. What, what's the problem with that? If she were to be cornered, well, she may even make up a confession. Make it up? Uh huh. So, they're gonna make it all our fault? Just because they feel like it? Yes. We haven't killed anyone, though. And we're you are still right. going to be arrested? You're both in the right. You'll be found guilty if you're caught. And it will be treated as a very serious crime. Bullshit! None of that makes any sense! Unfortunately, there's nothing I can do alone anymore to stop the flow of things. That's why you want our cooperation. Yes. In return, I'll turn a blind eye to what you've done. Those are my conditions. That said, I ask that you disband the Phantom Thieves after this. What should we do about akechi sons proposal? Be demanding a lot. I see. I thought I was making a lot of concessions myself. Well... You don't have to decide at the moment. Considering this is you we're talking about, I believe you'll come to a favorable reply. Shit. It's, I don't want to be bonding with him. All right. God damn it. I'm glad we could talk. I look forward to your answer. No, you don't. It's definitely worth coming today. For various reasons. You're an asshole. We should be getting back. About that. I'm sorry. Would it be acceptable if we ended the panel here? The reason why you called for me in the first place was because you wanted intel. Correct? My business is concluded as well. I'll deal with it somehow. Damn it! He had complete control over us! Well, we were in trouble. Hey, they're going! Huh? Oh, what the hell is going on? Oh boy. I'm sorry about the sudden break. An urgent task given. So, I truly apologize about this, but I'll have to end things here today. To make up for the time that was planned for this panel, the Rakugo Research Club will instead be... I can't say anything in detail regarding the Phantom Thieves' investigation, but I feel another great stride will occur again soon. I hope you all continue to pay attention to what happens. Let's have a big round of applause for today's guest, Goro Akechi. Was that really our best course of action? 
He totally used Makoto's suggestion against us. Indeed. We intended to get intel out of him, but to think it would play out like this. So what? We'll just accept his deal? He's got evidence on us. We really don't have a choice. Damn it! I guess so. What are we gonna do? Calm down, Ryuji. How am I supposed to calm down? What are we gonna do? Relax. Relax. We'll have to cool our heads and think more on this. We must make up our minds by the time he contacts us again. We need to give this a lot of thought. I will be giving this a lot of thought. This is not great. Similar occurrences followed in succession earlier this spring. Although things have quieted down until recently, several incidents have occurred once again. Furthermore, new information has come to light about the suspect who suffered sudden mental shutdown. He had received a calling card from the Phantom Thieves. Why did Futaba have something like this? Oh boy. If the calling card was delivered, we can only assume that the Phantom Thieves are behind it. If so, those occurrences back in spring can be attributed to them as well. Moreover... I knew it. She's... Oh, God. Oh, that's not great. The post-festival party is about to begin in the gymnasium. Please join us, everybody. Do you have any plans for today? All the girls are bombarding me with questions about Keiji Kun. No, it's go. It, it's done with Makoto. No. Sorry. Makoto. That sounds good. Not gonna go with Haru, not when the girlfriend asks you. for being so distracted. I can't stop thinking about Akechi-kun. Are we really no match for him? Don't worry, Makoto. I got this. Thank you. And now it's time for your favorite shoujin tradition, the student sharing special. Sharing? What, what, what are we sharing? This event is never very popular. The older teachers seem to enjoy it for some reason though. Oh, he's just sharing stuff. No? I'll just have to pick someone then. Oh, he's choosing from the crowd? The MC this year is actually somewhat capable. Ooh, is that our lovely student council president over there? Oh. Huh? Come on up here, Miss Prez. Do I have to go? Are you gonna ignore him? That cold. Everybody's waiting for you, Miss President. <sighs> Here she is, everyone's favorite student council president, Makoto Nijima san. Yay. Hello. Wow. I've always loved you. What? Now this is drama. A boy caught in the throes of their sweet youth. A stunning confession of love. For real? Wow, way to go. I think it was him. So, Miss President, what's your relation to this guy? Relation? My, she's red as a beet. 
Yay! I saved her. I think. I made a fool of myself. It was little hearts. Post festival party has never felt that long before. By the way, I'm surprised you were able to say what you did back there. Couldn't ignore you. Huh? I was at a complete loss for words. You really helped me. Thank you. This may be a little rude to say, but you were surprisingly reliable in a pinch. You're the one who chose to date me, so... My sister always says if I get married, my husband should be someone dependable like that. You asking for my hand oh, in marriage? Um, uh, forget what I just said. That was quick. <laughs> husband? everything that happened with the kun My final post festival party has turned out to be quite the unforgettable one. Make a move, dude. Oh, right. Here. Makoto's donuts. If you'd accept this. It looks delicious. I hope you enjoy it. Come. Let's go home. Your home or my home? Oh, you mean sep separate homes. Of course. Of course you did. Of course. Well. That was an adventure and a half, wasn't it? Hey. Hmm? I tried to find you, but I gave up pretty quickly. Oh. Sure. What do you want to talk about? The mass media has been causing quite a commotion lately. No countermeasure for the phantom thieves, the sorry state of the police, destruction of safety. They're saying whatever they want. So, how's the investigation progressing? Any clues yet? Nothing that leads to a firm conviction yet. What's going on here? Didn't you say that you were sure about closing this case? And I thought I told you that failure won't be tolerated. <laughs> well, this is troublesome. If things continue at this rate, never mind a promotion. Oh. But, sir. Straight up fired. I had high expectations for you. But it seems this task was too much to handle for someone so young. We may need to reform the operation as well, since the selected personnel for this. Please, let me see this through to the end. This case is something that I've always. I know that you've been at this for a while now. Even before the police spared us the staff for it. If you can manage an arrest, I've made special arrangements so that you can question them personally. That's what you want, isn't it? The leadership of this country is about to change. We can't let this case carry over into their term. I'll make myself clear again. Failure isn't an option. We need results. I understand. Do you really? You're allowed to take some bold measures if you need to. Well, we considering she caught me, I'm, I'm, I'm no certain she did her job well. Oh, one more thing. If the unexpected happens to occur, contact me immediately. To you, sir? I said that failure isn't an option, didn't I? Yes. Everything is proceeding as planned. <laughs> Jesus Christ. We're home! 
And now it's a problem. I was cleaning up and found this. <gasps> this is a calling card, right? I read about it online, too. Y you went into my room without my permission? I'll apologize as much as you want later. So, what is this? That's... Is it something to get flustered over? I knew it. This isn't just some game you're playing. Why aren't you saying anything? Why did you keep it? I mean, it was memorable. Explain. Explain. Is it something that you can't explain? Explain. Oh, she's out of breath. Oh boy. Hey, if this keeps up, Futaba's. I'll explain everything. You will, huh? Yes, I will. I'll get right to the point. Is this a real one? Was a, well, a change of heart triggered in you? <laughs> How about it? Ever since Mom died, I, there was n no exit. I was trapped in, in a labyrinth of my heart. I knew I had to leave it, but I, I couldn't do it by myself. Futaba. Oh boy. Here, sit down. I can at least listen to what you have to say. The Phantom Thieves saved me. They stole my messed up heart. It's the same as Mom's research. They changed my cognition. <laughs> oh, boy. Seriously? <sighs> Okaba's research about altering one's cognition. I wondered about it myself, too. Still. When did you notice? When she said she was going to go to the beach out of nowhere. And even the doctors had thrown in the towel. <laughs> At first, I just chalked it up as other kids being a better support for you than any adult. But as I kept watching the tabloid shows here, day in and day out, a thought crossed my mind. I thought your case kind of seemed similar to what these phantom thieves were doing. <gasps> wow! I'm still your guardian, you know. I'd never overlook such a drastic change in your behavior. So, Jiro. But to think that Wakaba's research and the Phantom Thieves changing hearts were about the same thing. <sighs> Back in the day, I used to be a government official. My job was to be the bridge between the country and the lab that Wakaba worked at. It's around that time that I got to know her. She said something odd when we were out drinking, that she might soon die in an odd way. I'm just not speaking through this because like this is actually quite compelling. Who wouldn't take that as a joke? I just laughed it off. But it happened exactly as she said. If anything were to happen to you, I'd feel like I let her down. There's something I want to ask you. Judging from your attitude, you knew about this calling card, didn't you? You should have known that Futaba had a change of heart through the Phantom Thieves as well. Is there a connection between you and them? The first incident of a change of heart was a teacher at your school. The kid who brought that painting here was a pupil of that artist who had a change of heart, wasn't he? And then, there's Futaba. These scandals always seem to find their way around you. What do you have to say? You're sharp. You think this is a game? No. These people are called criminals by the general public. Why did you introduce such dangerous people to Futaba? That's not true! I asked them! That's why he saved me! He stole my heart! Oh, god damn it! Asked? Stole? Wait, are you saying that 
He's the one who changed your heart? So, he's not connected with the Phantom Thieves, but is one himself? <laughs> You're pulling my leg, aren't you? I am a Phantom Thief. Are you serious? You really are a Phantom Thief? Oh, for crying out loud! Sojiro! So, basically, I've been sheltering a Phantom Thief for the last six months. And on top of that, Futaba's involved too. What the hell? I... I want to find the culprit who killed my mom. Wait, it killed? There we go. She was killed. I... remember it now. Stop this nonsense! No, you Why stop. Why you believe me? Are you the same as everyone else? Didn't you know already? The way Mom died wasn't normal! Didn't you notice that her research was stolen by someone? Sojiro! When she passed away, I did think it was odd. It was awfully fishy. But what could I do? All I was able to do was run from it all. And the outcome of that was me spending my retirement here. Also, the reason I took custody of you was me trying to selfishly atone for what happened to Wakaba. It's basically my fault that you got burdened with all this crap. It's not your fault, Sojiro. I acted all big, lectured, even yelled at you kids. And in the end, I'm the one being consoled. <laughs> I'm hopeless and a laughingstock, aren't I? That's not true. I mean, the one who killed Mom's the one at fault. <sighs> I see. Don't worry. Even if you are the real Phantom Thieves, I have no intention of reporting or kicking you out. <laughs> I mean, who would believe such a story? The police? Unless they catch you red-handed, it's impossible to explain that you're the Phantom Thieves. Let me just say one thing, though. Immediately back out of a fight that you can't win. What do you mean? Don't you get it? If, by chance, you pissed off the same guys that killed Wakaba, then they're not someone that kids like you can deal with. Listen to reason, all right? We're done talking about this. Let's eat. I'm so hungry because I raised my voice so much. Uh, at least we avoided the worst case scenario of being reported arbitrarily. Still, we should tell the others about what just happened. Uh, I'm tired. Guys, Sojiro knows. It'll be fine. No. It will all be fine. Do you say boss had to run from it all? Someone very powerful. Impossible? Yes, we can. We are going to win this. Hey. Wait, Futaba's still here. How am I going to get some sleep? Don't be silly. Sofa. Hey. Yeah, you can. <laughs> no, no. Ah. Well then. All right, I'm going to bed. <laughs>